So you're thinking about starting a blog, but you're not sure if you wanna go with WordPress or Blogger. In this video, I'm gonna talk about the differences between the two and which platform you should use to start your blog. What's up guys, I'm Andy, you're watching Learn How, and I help people learn how to use technology to build an online business and create a life of freedom. Now in this video, I do have a big announcement to make. That big announcement is that I have this jar of goldfish right here. If you wanna leave a comment and guess how many goldfish you think are in this jar, I am selecting the winner in an upcoming video, whoever is closest to win an Amazon gift card. Speaking of Amazon gift cards, we have a new Amazon gift card winner to announce in this video. Congratulations to Aleda. Aleda. Man, I'm so bad at names on this thing. Aleda, you have won an Amazon gift card. Send me an email to winner at learnhowgroup.com. Thank you so much for leaving a comment. Every week I'm giving out an Amazon gift card to one lucky winner, someone who is supporting me, liking, commenting, subscribing to my YouTube channel. All right, let's get to the content of this video. WordPress versus Blogger. Which platform should you use to start your blog? First, I wanna talk about WordPress. WordPress is, if, if you're in the blogging sphere at all, if you've heard of it, if you started investigating blogging, I guarantee you've heard the word WordPress. WordPress is a content management system that is free to use to build an online website slash blog. So, with WordPress, you need self-hosting. I've got a ton of videos on my channel that talk about where to find a domain name, how to get hosting, how to install WordPress, all of the instructions you can find here on my YouTube channel. So make sure you go browse through those videos to get all those instructions. But in my opinion, WordPress is the best and should be the only way that you start a blog in 2019. Let's talk really quickly about Blogger and why you might be tempted to go the Blogger route. Blogger, or commonly known as Blogspot, was a platform built by Google that was extremely popular in the early days of blogging, you know, 10 or 15 years ago. It's free to use, it's very simple. Literally, you just use your Google account, you set up a page, and you just blog. People can come, leave comments. I know a lot of people who still blog on Blogger and get a lot of traffic. The real nice thing, or I guess the only real nice benefit of Blogger is that it's free. So you don't have to pay for any hosting. Uh, you don't have to worry about any sort of you know limits for traffic and things like that. But it is very basic. It is very limited as far as design goes, as far as what you can do with it. I do believe that it does work with Google AdSense, so you can have Google Ads on your page to earn some income but I just feel like it's so limited in what you can do. And I know so many people who get down the road with Blogger or, or Blogspot and they're to the point where they're like, ooh, I realize now that I can't really do everything that I wanna do now that my blog is starting to get up some, some momentum. How do I switch to WordPress? And that is just a big hassle. There's a lot of work that you do not want to go through. People who don't make the switch to WordPress end up just being like, well, darn, I'm stuck here on Blogger and they just kind of keep going with the flow uh, because they're too scared to start over and lose all the momentum that they've gained. So, you know, it is, it gets very technical as soon as you want to start to switch from Blogger to WordPress. So my recommendation is start from WordPress, start with WordPress from the beginning. It's super cheap. You can use SiteGround, Bluehost. They're super cheap per month. It's like, $3 a month for hosting, uh, which is affordable for anyone. Just, you know, skip a cheeseburger once next month and then you, you can pay for it. Uh, but it's the best way to start your blog or website. Let me go into WordPress for my blog to show you kind of just basically how it looks on the back end. Right here, I'm, I'm in WordPress, signed in to my blog. Over here on the left, you can see there's like a big menu of different like features and settings and things. I'm just right here and creating a new post. So this is how you'd go about writing a blog article in WordPress. You simply just go in here and just like, you know, type type out your blog article, uh, format it however you want. There's all the formatting stuff up here. And then there's some different settings over here on the right. You can add images, whatever. It, it, it's, it's really straightforward. And there's a ton of tutorials online to help you get started. My channel, I talk a lot. I do a lot of WordPress tutorials. Uh, it's very easy. But then let me, I'll just show you what it looks like. So like this is what my blog looks like if you were just reading it on the internet. It would look like this right here. 
Uh, I embed a YouTube video from my channel and then there's all the text and my Pinterest pin. And then people can leave comments or whatever and it, it looks, you know, like a website. So this is WordPress. Let me show you, let me see if I can find uh, a blog spot, um, blog to show you uh, kind of what it looks like. Oh, I actually, oh, I have a blogger for this account. Okay, so here's blogger. Hey guys, blah, blah. I'm just creating a new post. I didn't really know I had this account. Let's preview it and see what it looks like. Okay, this is my blog spot blog, powered by blogger. So it looks like your post, you know, would be written out right there. Oh, ads go here. So you can put ads right down there at the bottom. Preview. It's changed quite a bit over the years, uh, but still just, just very limited. Like this is basically it. Pages, created a new page. Uh, Blogger is very simple, but it's just, I don't know, it's so limited in what you can do. And once you start to gain some momentum and really see that your blog can become a business, you're gonna be very limited in what you can do with Blogger. If you do plan on monetizing your blog more than just using Google AdSense, which is what you're going to need if you wanna make a, like an income from your blog, I highly recommend you stick with WordPress. Now, right over here on my website, learnhowblogging.com, I literally teach you how to set up a WordPress blog. There's a huge button on my homepage that takes you to this page with all the step-by-step -step instructions. Look, I got a ton of videos on there to help you out every step of the way to get your blog up and running. I tell you literally everything to even click. Uh, so if you have any questions on starting your blog with WordPress, leave a comment and let me know. I'd be happy to help you out however I can. Don't forget to leave your goldfish guess uh, and I'm gonna pick the winner uh, for that in an upcoming video. And if you like this video, guys, hit the thumbs up for me. Leave your feedback, I really appreciate it. And if you didn't like it, hit the thumbs down. You know, I don't really care if you liked it or disliked it. I just want you to tell me what you thought of the video. It really means a lot to me and helps me provide better value to you. Once again, guys, I'm Andy. You're watching Learn How. We'll see you in the next video.